what is the future of learning? Could it be that we are heading towards or maybe in a future when knowing is obsolete? Could it be that we don't need to go to school at all? Could it be that at the point in time when you need to know something, you can find out in two minutes? My wish is to build a facility where children go on these intellectual adventures driven by the big questions which their mediators put in. It's a facility which is practically unmanned. It will be called a school in the cloud. Good teachers don't go to remote places. The remoter you get, the worse primary education becomes. I don't know how to build a school in the cloud because I've never built one. So I'm trying to figure out a design which, really speaking, belongs to children and is run by children. So that's what's going on. It's a great big experiment. Schools as we know them now, they're outdated. As soon as I started doing it and seeing the buzz and the enjoyment of the kids, it made me look at my lessons differently and the role of a teacher differently, less talking at the front and more handing it over to the children. I really like it because it's independent and you to work with your friends. Kurakarti may or may not be different from the schools of England, that's what we are going to look for. The idea is to have a complete glass front to a building here and a large screen for a full-size Skype-in mediator. In tunnel, we have to be London to get London to computer. We have to be able to have All I ever really wanted to know about computers was how to turn them off. Hi. Hello, Rabin. Hello, Ajay. How nice to see you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look what I made. Can you see what this is? Sab jagay pray in Brazil. Am choto bala theke jodi shiki ta hole amar boro hole ta hun aro bhalo bhabe shikte parbo. You help a child to the point where if he wants to know something, he knows where to look for it and how to look for it. The more affluent children have people who will help them to learn anyway. But it's children in desolate areas who really desperately need to know how to learn. And I know that the internet does that. Learning itself is actually an emergent phenomenon, it's like a hive or like a thunderstorm. It's not about making learning happen, it's about letting it happen.